That sucked. Hand clap to the master guys. We're definitely back again for another one. Or the one and only, the only brothers and sisters, Mysterix Reacts Channel. Big up all the Mysterix family for tuning into another vibrations right there. And of course, the newcomers, big up yourself as well. Big up the newcomers out there, out and large, all over the world. Big up the UK Massive. Actually, met some UK Massive last night. They don't actually watch a reaction video, but they tend to watch the vlog videos. So big them up one time. I told them about the reactions, and they said they're gonna tune in to the vibrations right there because of course they wanna know about Dominic and what have you and all the kind of something there. That's one thing with you guys. I don't like to lie to people, and I always tell to tell people tend to tell people the truth on certain things, give them a good, the bad, and, and and so forth. This is why the reasons they actually came to Dominica in the first place because they like my vibes, and of course I tend to tell it like it is. Of course, through the vlogs and what have you, where I go out there and whatnot, talking about different things and whatnot. They said that they used to watch my previous videos where I sit down in front of the wall and something, and decided to talk to, talk to the masses, and they, they used to watch that and enjoy it. So they know about the aspect of, of these things and prepared themselves before they came in to Dominica for a little um, vacation and what have you. So big them up right there. If they've tuned in, big up yourself one time. You guys know yourselves as well. I don't have to call you. <coughs> I don't have to call on him, but big up the Mr. Lee family, of course, for definitely that vibrations right there. Guys, don't forget to download the app. Download the app right there. I keep saying to myself I need to do a thorough with it and show you guys and whatnot. But guys, download the app. That'll be the first comment in the comment box below. This is where I tend to combine all previous videos and, of course, new videos, latest videos and whatever. You pretty much get it right on the spot. Of course, the Mr. Lee's family had that on his stuff yesterday. I actually posted it where he was actually watching from the television. And I think, well, nothing. I, definitely from the app right there where he was watching so big up all of them who have downloaded the app on their televisions as well man that is a heck of a thing man never in my life would i ever thought that i would have an app and people downloading the app on their tv brothers and sisters. on the tv the television set you can't download it on, on them box tv brothers and sisters you 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 no you need to download it on your smart tv <laughs> anyways guys we've got that steady right there you can pretty much see this video of course which a number of persons sent to me i think they received this video like 10 times and of course, I received it yet again today. I forgot how to upload it. But of course, I received it yet again today. And of course, this is Shiba, of course, doing some waxing, man. Wax on wax of Mr. Miyagi, brothers and sisters. Mr. Miyagi! <laughs> of course. And of course, this is Shiba right there. <laughs> Let's go back, Shibos. <laughs> That come out from the root, man, Shiba. That come out. That that is. You know when you plant seed in ground, brothers and sisters, and you have to uproot the seed from the stems, ah, from the stalk, brother. Ah, yeah, yeah. I suspect it's all that that come out there. The seed, man. <laughs> the seed of Shiba mustache. <laughs> hey, I'm just thinking of this, man. Yes, the seed come out, Shiba. Oaks. Next side, I have to do. <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. That one is the worst one, but the other is easy. The other is here. I like, I like that person confidence. The others are easy. Papa, what day, boy? Look, wait a while. <laughs> Me say quick. Yes, sir. Uh, mustache have to come out, we. Moustache have to come out. <laughs> they take a cheap moustache. <laughs> this was pretty funny. Right there. But hey, you have to do what you have to do, eh, brothers and sisters. If you have to wax, wax on, wax off Mr. Miyagi, man, of course. You can do that to yourself. <laughs> Shiba, you, you'll be surprised what people just do with that, you know. <laughs> Where they just take on here. <laughs> you take on from your lip, people just take on here. All kind of places, them kind of thing there. Ah oh boy, I don't even want to go there before YouTube decide they come in behind me. <laughs> Anyways, guys. She will carry his eyes on her face, man. That, that, that day, we she books. Anyways, moving along, guys. Domlek. We're back to the Domlek massive right there. And of course, as you can see right there, guys, somebody has messaged Domlek. I don't know if he's on Facebook or whatnot. But the person saying, all oh, you can come and take all you meet, are we? I'll use candle. It seems like all you following what scary told you to do. Scary say burn candle, candle must burn. <laughs> burn candle, burn. <laughs> Brothers and sisters, I don't burn in no freaking candle. I burn that. I have my solar lights. I make sure when I come down, I bring down a set of solar lights for Dominican. So all you can burn all your solar lights. <laughs> Put it outside in the sun. Nighttime, rich. Turn off your light, man. Actually, did that some time back, you know. Like about two or three days ago. I decided to turn off all the lights. 
and I just had my solar lights on, man, and they were like bright in the place, man. But I say, so was lights go. You can't take chances, brothers and sisters. You take chances, light go boom. <laughs> Your solar light down no more energy again. No more sun in night time, you check? So I say, I don't know that I'm saving that for when them days come. By the way, guys, bro, talk about that. They have hurricane season. Uh, should I put that out? Let me put it out, man. I'll put it out. And this is it right there, brothers and sisters. So apparently, hurricane season for 2022, the names, I think I put, posted this sometime earlier, stating that Gaston was actually on it. And of course, a number of um, 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 names have been placed there. I think there's actually one in the Mexico region right now, brothers and sisters. I think that is Alex. I'm not too sure. I think I saw a snippet of that, but I wasn't paying attention. You guys can pretty much check it out for yourself. This is a reaction, of course. Go and do your research, brothers and sisters. So see if it's true or not. But I think Hurricane Alex is around Me Mexico area. And I think, um, you know, it's May 31st right now, brothers and sisters. Hurricane season is tomorrow. <laughs> you see me? Tomorrow is hurricane season, brothers and sisters. Anyways, let me go back to what I was talking about. So apparently, hurricane season coming. Domlek is another problem. Domlek is our present hurricane season, apparently. Our hurricane um, um, at, at this present time. And of course, a number of persons has a number of things to say. That one say you want to burn his candle. They want to listen to scary and whatnot. That one say to people that. Still buying. I can still buy KFC every week now, boy. Where where do you guys work? <laughs> they working in in, in Clay Harbor. <laughs> I don't know, no, boy. Where they working? I don't know. Unless I want to know what kind of jobs do you do, man? Well, let's hope it's not drugs. Because to be to be buying KFC at this present time, brothers and sisters, <laughs> drugs not too fast. But YouTube, YouTube, mind me, please. <laughs> YouTube, mind me, please. <laughs> All right then. But of course, this individual is asking to the people that I can still buy KFC every week. Where do you guys work? What kind of jobs do you do? Of course, pertinent individuals are trying to know these answers in this nature. I love the Caribbean, Dominican. Not only that, no brothers and sisters. But somebody wrote this thing. Not taken away. Not taken we. I'm going to sell both my fridge money after we make and save money too. When you sell your fridge, your fridge, sometimes it's your fridge that cost most of the money. I remember. My uncle, them, when I saw their bills for fridge, they have two fridge, brothers and sisters, and their bill is ten dollars. We, I say, what? <laughs> ay, ay, ay. Ten dollars we for the whole month. <laughs> their bill is for fridge, because I think they have different sections and whatnot. It hanging on so they know to read and all kind of thing, man. Fridge, both fridge, and them fridge looking like they pulling, they pulling gas, boy. They pulling gas, hey. <laughs> But apparently it's ten dollars, we five dollars for one, five dollars for the other one, and hey, things are things. But maybe go up now, maybe go up to five fifty. <laughs> but in Dominica, it's another story, brothers and sisters. But this individual said that they're gonna be selling both for their fridge, fire burn that salt, half he make ding dang on fish. No more putting fish in fridge. Put it in salt, man. Let it soak, soak it from its head, down to its toes. Anyways, brothers and sisters, one of since. Last month, so the person turned off one fridge, the other fridge still functioning right there. They turned off the other fridge. You're checking out, man. Bill, same thing, we. So, when you're thinking that you're going to make less money or well, you're going to save more money, not the case at all, brothers and sisters. Best you put back on your fridge because if both fridge still have the same as one fridge, but you turn it off again, brothers and sisters, it makes no sense. Bill, same thing. This month, I put in up both. No TV, nothing going on, bare darkness. We have to, we have to. <laughs> I was going to say put foil paper outside and let light shine in, but <laughs> it does sun in the night time. <laughs> okay, brothers and sisters. So that is another case right there. So this, of course, my, one of my friends sent me this message. She was listening to Q95 and say, Lennox is funny, you know. <laughs> she was kidding. <laughs> she was joking, laughing. Giggy gagoa. <laughs> Lennox say not even a light bulb is powered by geothermal energy, but, but the government talking about geothermal energy after they already put one million ah, yeah, yeah. guys what that million dollars is it's a lot of money. <laughs> Just in case you don't know, you might say boy five hundred thousand mm, but a million is double that brothers and sisters, okay? That is double of 500 tall, brothers and sisters. My partner say he buy, he buy something in past post month. Junior say he buy a shoe for a hundred tall. <laughs> well, it's ten times that, brothers and sisters. He buy shoes for a hundred tall. But that one is a million dollars that going to geothermal. And not even a light bulb. That on 
as a result of one million dollars being put into geothermal. But the labor rights out there will be happy. Yes, yes. <laughs> we get him down like back and we clap him. And all of them quiet today. They quiet, brothers and sisters. You know why? Because they realize that what the decisions of the government is also affecting them. So some of them burning candle since Dom Dominica government take over Dom Lake. They burning candle. And they save their little five dollars electricity to charge their phone so they can text and WhatsApp saying, Give me a little five dollars now, please. <laughs> Give me a five dollars. No! No five dollars for you. Stop your dirty ways. Anyways, Lennox Clinton was this. I actually went to the she sent me the link for this. I actually went to listen to some of what they were saying right there. And this is what Lennox had to say about the company that had majority shares and what they were saying in regards to what the Prime Minister was saying, which is contradictory to what the Prime Minister is saying right there. Listen to this. Domlek was included in the other electric in the in the other electric segment in quarter one of 2022. The sale did not have a material impact on earnings. So it did not have a material impact on the earnings of the present shift between one to the other. It was pretty easy to make the shift and it did not affect earnings. Let's continue. That's Amira. Amira. With all that you heard. I keep calling the company. I, I, I don't know if it's Amira, but Lennox say Amira. So. Yes. That's a mirror. Okay, then. Uh, with all that you heard from Roosevelt's in the, par in, the par in the parliament, that, that's what the mirror said. <laughs> so, but brothers and sisters, there's a problem with Dominicans. Dominicans just seem to swallow. And this is what I, I am so glad that I decided to pursue the career of a journal investigative journalist, guys. Because I get to find out information. I know to find information. I know all these things, the right legitimate information and all this kind of something there. On these reactions, I just tend to give my opinions based on my research done, not necessarily thorough. This is why you guys also need to go do your research on other things like BRB, PTV, and the media stuff. When I'm doing, when I put out stuff out there, it is definite research that can be um, backed up by credible resources, re credible sources and what have you. So I'm just giving my views on the reactions and whatnot. You guys do your research. But best of, everything's steady right there. It's common sense as well. To understand that if your bill was $500 last month, and it is now $750 and you are losing le using less electricity than you were using last month. Something, brothers and sisters, have to be wrong. No, I exaggerated the price in $500 and $750. Don't make a difference. No, why is $50 you pay to $100? It is still a huge difference, brothers and sisters. But anyways, it seems like Dominicans have a problem. Dominicans just seem to swallow whatever people want to tell them because they're in society or they have some certain offices not realizing that these people at the top who are the most set of corrupt people in the world are, co are politicians. And yet still we are choosing to believe politicians based on the words that we're saying because, not on the basis of fact, but because we support them. Ah. Let's get another phone call. Are you there? Yeah, good afternoon uh, to you, Mr. Pelty, and good, good afternoon, afternoon yes. to uh -huh. the opposition leader, uh, Mr. Linda. Good afternoon, sir. Um, <laughs> first of, yeah, how are you doing, man? Hey, first of all, I, I want to commend you immensely for being the buffer between the madness and Dominica. And the man telling the truth we. Lennox has been telling the truth. The man is also, I, 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 and I respect in Lennox as an investigative journalist himself. Me, I am more of an international looking for different things to see how it affects Dominic and this kind of things. So he's looking from out, inside out. I'm looking from outside in. What affects Dominic and this kind of things then and tell the people about it. And this information right there is right in people's face. You going for it in your house. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And you still saying, boy, leave a party. <laughs> what is this song they are sing now? I can't remember. Anyways, let's continue right there. Big up Lennox on the vibes. His talent and skills is being used in Dominican. Yet still, people still allowing themselves to be bamboozled. Even though they don't know the truth. And you cannot tell me they don't know the truth, brothers and sisters. Because I've been talking to them in Portsmouth. And they tell me what I said is the truth. Guys, this is the reason why I was saying that. Let me talk to the liberal rights. Because liberal rights are watching my videos. They know what I said is true. <laughs> that is, why are you mad? They know what I say is true. 
But they're still going to repeat the same thing that keeping them oppressed. That is not people are ignorant. No, no more brothers and sisters. That is wicked people. They're wicked. But let them continue. All I know, brothers and sisters, this is why I tell people, hey, if your country is keeping you down, trying to be patriotic to the very country that is keeping you down, is a tug of war, brothers and sisters. Because you're trying to be patriotic with the very thing that is keeping you down. This is why a lot of people are going overseas and they say, boy, they sell their flag. Reginald himself admit there are a number of people overseas that cannot come back. They, what they coming back for? Because they don't have papers and whatnot. But what they coming back for? They risking, they risking their own freedom, so to speak. Because if they catch them and whatnot or whatnot, they'll be in jail for some time before they deport them or whatnot. You know how the system rolls. They're literally risking their own freedom for them to escape Dominica. And you're pretending as if Dominica is so nice, man. Dominica is nice, and don't get me wrong, you know, guys. Don't get, don't get me wrong. Dominican nature, you come to the beach, you come to free up, you come to Jazz and Creole, World Creole Music Festival, you come to a number of nice activities taking place in Dominica, you come to just lime, meet new people. Dominica, one of the, some of the most friendliest people on planet Earth. They're more friendly outside that I notice, eh? Because when they see other Dominicans, we just are so crazy. We don't know who you be, though, but once we know you Dominican, <laughs> we having a ball of our time. I remember when I went on a cruise around the Statue of Liberty. It was me and my friends, and we met other Dominicans and Caribbean people, brothers and sisters. Hey, eh, once we Caribbean, we Caribbean, we vibes, man. <laughs> I have that on a mistakes vlogs. <laughs> you guys will have to go and check it out yourself. <laughs> But anyways, guys, with all what is being stated right there, Dominicans need to open up their eyes, man. I think Dominicans need to open up their eyes, and I, I keep talking. And, 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 and the people of all this year. And it's sad that our people don't read, our people don't listen. And too many times we make decisions based on emotions and not Feelings. Ah, ah! Hand clap to that caller, hand clap. They make him... Um, and decisions based on feelings, brothers and sisters. And that is a huge problem. You do not ever make decisions on your feelings. They tell you about God feelings. Throw that out the window, brothers and sisters. You must make feelings on proper context. You must make um, decisions. I want to say make feelings. You must make decisions on the proper context. On the proper informed context, brothers and sisters. And when you know what things are happening to you and the Prime Minister keep trying to coax you, coax you, let me say coax you, coax you. Yeah, he's a body, man, I say body, ha. I say body, we, yes. But then at the end of the day, he's making you pay more money while VAT still the same and telling you that he's trying to decrease it. <laughs> he's trying to decrease tariffs when he can do it by a VAT. He could at least say, boy, you know what, guys, let's decrease VAT for at least six months on electricity. Let's do that. Let's bring it to 7.5 and then after the six months, we'll see how things go and then we'll, you know, make things a bit easier for individuals. No, you talk about tariffs. Which tariff that can change? You in charge of tariffs? President, let me continue. And instead of digging deep for the meat of the situation, <laughs> we, so we are satisfied with whatever we are explanation without you guys probably didn't hear that. Satisfied with just surface explanation without... Satisfied with, with just surface explanation? Because my PM said that I believe him. That's why I don't believe nobody. That's why I always used to tell people back in the day. Well, I even telling people now, don't just take my word for it, you know. Don't just take my word for it. Sometimes I come and say things that might be crazy, but it's true. <laughs> because I remember enough times when everybody was against me even here on this not on this channel, my previous channel when I used to give views on the certain things and everybody was against me until they find out what I said was true is they strong? <laughs> is they strong? the whole world can be against me brothers and sisters if you know the facts for yourself and that's why nobody, nobody wants to know the facts all you do is less of the prime minister talking on camera and thing and saying this and that he said international airport will build in 2014. He said the day after he win, it will start. 
<laughs> Brothers and sisters, grass chicken. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. Hey, grass. Grass, brothers and sisters, I passed there on May Day. Grass taking the same spot that they say they make in International Airport for. That's if they do the aerial shot, they call me to do to see if we're swampies and this kind of things there. They called me to do aerial shot. Let me continue. Getting ourselves um, informed. We don't want to get ourselves informed. Why? I think there's a human condition for this thing. Sometimes you are scared of the facts. So we are comfortable living a lie because if the facts are true, even though they are, but in our minds, if the facts are true, we are in trouble. This is one of the problems I notice with labor rights. They believe a lot in hope. They believe, they, they believe a lot in hope. Having hope. They constantly have hope. People have said this, no, no, that scary them come back, they can right the wrongs. But when they come back, every time that they are coming back in government, it is for us. Brothers and sisters, you mean to tell me 10 years ago we wasn't better off than we are today? 10 years previous before that we wasn't better off than the 10 years before today? Brothers and sisters. Anyways, I have to show this right there because a the number of persons probably don't seem to understand what they're reading. This is from Domlek, brothers and sisters, and Domlek is saying, with the rising cost of fuel on the world market, that is the basis right there. They are factual about this thing. It's on the world market as have nothing to do with Russia. They are only adapting to the changes because we don't get fuel from Russia. Correct me if I'm wrong, brothers and sisters. We're getting fuel from there. We're getting fuel from Ukraine. That's where we're getting our stuff. It is the market value that is going up. Therefore, prices are going up. Not necessarily pertaining to us, but because the market is going up, everybody bringing up stuff, and that is, that is then creating more profits for them. This is why Domleg had to send out, or could send out, their workers to go and learn karate. <laughs> I just said what I want in this regard right there. But you get the point, brothers and sisters. With the rising cost of fuel on the world market, we have prepared this graph which gives a clear picture of the effects of the cost of fuel on the cost of electricity. Dominica is not immune to the high fuel prices. And so we urge all our customers to burn candle. Uh, all our customers to conserve electricity as much as possible right there. No, guys, I want you guys to see this thing. This is what I was talking about yesterday. The variations in thing. Now, a number of persons might think this is the increase in, in price um, for fuel rotation per kilowatt. No, guys. That is the change in the price. In other words, this was 23 cents back in the day. This is not 38 cents now in January, brothers and sisters. This is 60 cents in January. So I made a mistake yesterday saying it was 20 cents. This is 2021. I was talking about 2021, not 2022. So in 2021, in January, it was 23 cents, brothers and sisters. January 2022 now, it is not 38 cents, brothers and sisters. It is 60 cents. It was 60 cents in January. This is not 47 cents, brothers and sisters. You have to look at the gra graph right there. February, it's uh, almost 80 cents. 7, 7, 14, 2, 74, 72. Brothers and sisters. 72 cents right there. Right there, brothers and sisters. This is 72 cents in February. It went up by... It, from this, this is a difference, brothers and sisters. The difference between this total, which is 80-something dollars, 80, 80 cents, to this. The difference between that 80-something cents to that gives you that total that you've seen right there. A difference of 52 cents they didn't put the 80 cents instead this one is 84 30 84 yes brothers and sisters 85 59 6 5 85 right there brothers and sisters 85 cents the difference between 85 cents and 30 cents in april is 54 cents right there brothers and sisters it from you can see the trajectory right there brothers and sisters it seems like things slow down in that area but apparently when it comes down to may which is the end of this is this is May today, brothers and sisters. It went up by a dollar and something. Six sixty-eight thirty-three three one. So a dollar, well, a dollar. Don't make much of a difference right there. So a dollar right there, brothers and sisters, went up to a dollar in May. 
So from 61 cents or 60 cents to a dollar in five months, he will surcharge rate from um, 2022 versus 2021. So people who couldn't read and think it go back 68 cents, no brothers and sisters, it is a dollar. Look it right there. That is what you have to read because people were trying to make noise with me like I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> oh, you deadly in that place, I have one more thing to show, which I had to show some individual from them. Like I tell him to break it down for me, but apparently he laps. So anyways, let me show it to you guys. This is it right there, brothers and sisters. From this person, I have no idea who that is. But this person is saying electricity increase is pure madness. Consumption, 10461. Vat, vat still remains the same. Fuel surcharge, 11.18. Right there in totality. When fuel surcharge is higher than the consumption, that is a formula to lead to poverty. Electricity is basic need. Everybody needs it. But in this present time, electricity is a basic need considering that we are computer, we're in the computer age and computers definitely the electricity. So definitely that is the case right there, especially for comfort on the other side, the comfort zone right there to leave more comfort. Although comfort is not a need or is not a, 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 a prerequisite for need. But in these modern days, it is definitely something that people have adapted to and thus the case right there. Well, I guess we have informed, brothers and sisters, we have informed in this nature of the Caribbean Dominica. And don't get me wrong, I understand that, yeah, electricity price, people are adapting as a result. But I remember people like Mia Motley. Mia Motley, you know what they did as a result of their gas prices going up? She decreased VAT. You know what the um, St. Kitts Prime Minister them did? They decided to add surplus on people's monies. And also give the poor, the, 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 the unemployed, I won't say the poor, well, if you don't have a job, sometimes you can be considered poor. But in the basis of that, that's, that's not, anyways. But the, what they did, they gave the unemployed people $1,000 to help, you know? And they say for the next three, three months or something like that, I think it's the last month, maybe two months remaining in this regard right there. You're going to be increasing that right there. So they're actually helping their people. What did the Prime Minister of Dominica do? Tell people about geothermal, not even the light bulb that burning on geothermal at present with a million dollars of the people's money being used. Not only that, but also telling the people lies after lies and telling them that they're trying to, to, to decrease the prices on the people while increase. Are you telling people they're trying to decrease the price on people and you're increasing prices and that is still the same, which means you're getting more money now than you was getting before. Anyways, guys, do all I said, let me know your thoughts in the comment box below. I will see you guys in the next reaction video. Give this video if, a thumbs up if you understand it. And if you want to see more, definitely subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next one. Boom, bam.